All right, just finished the lesson with one kid. And when we were done, they were like, hey, mom, find all the hidden H's that I placed on this page. The things that kids come up with, it just cracks me up. So there's one. I'm going to be honest. This one, I had a hard time finding. <laughs> they thought that was hilarious. They hid one there and there. The no hidden so one in here? Yep. I couldn't see that I one. I know. It was tricky. And never mind the after school time mess. Though. I just saw a circle. Or the school time mess. We're not done. So it's not after school. But yeah, I know it does look like a circle. Toddlers, school, messes galore. All right, moving on to the next kid. Ah, oh, good morning, everybody. I don't think I've officially said good morning so far. So good morning. So I'm done doing school with Reagan and Harper. And then I'm going to call Jackson and Nex and do school with him. We also did, you know, our morning time. And then after Jackson, I like to sit down with Miley and Logan um, together. Jackson and Logan have done math as well. And older kids are using the computer, so then Miley will do math when one of the older girls is done. It's, I jokingly call our homeschool a three ring circus because it doesn't always make sense, but we, we figure it out and we get it done and we work together for the most part. <laughs> we make lots of messes along the way. Y'all saw that, right? So I'm going to actually get that cleaned up before I call Jackson in. But we have started reading Farmer Boy again. I just love the Little House series, y'all. It's just so sweet. I've been watching it here and there, um, not all too often. I, I wish that we could sit down and just binge watch the Little House um, show, but we we gotta get schoolwork done too. But anyways, maybe we'll have time to watch an episode today. I don't know. I do have a dentist appointment later on today, so probably not. Anyways, but I just love the Little House series. I watched it um, with the older girls, not the full series, just um, some of it, but I just love that. And the little girls are enjoying it as well. And Logan. Um, it has just been a sweet time. So, all right, I'm going to get this stuff cleaned up and then call Jackson in. Set my book up before, you know, I lose it. So, all the paper mess, um, that tends to keep toddlers entertained um, when you're doing reading louds. Ow. Sorry. I stubbed my toe. <laughs> it tends to keep the little ones entertained, like coloring. Um, this morning it was cutting. They had a smaller pair of scissors and then... The, they were Reagan, so Reagan got them and put them up, and then they found the big pairs of scissors. So, all right, get all that stuff cleaned up, and then we will um, move it along with our school day. Oh my goodness, look at this! This is what they were cutting out. Was they made little hand prints? They traced their hands, um, colored them, and hung them up on the fridge. Did you see that? Okay, gonna get this cleaned up. So, okay, so Reagan and I are gonna make some beeswax candles. So I kind of felt inspired. I already had the supplies, but then I saw these at Goodwill, and these, these were just so like pretty. They look like glass cups, like for like tea cups. Yeah. So I think they're actually known as pudding cups, maybe. Um, they were a dollar each. I it's just so thought pretty. those would be so pretty. So. So I was actually, four dollars. Exactly. So I actually only have three wicks though, so we're just gonna make three of them. But Reagan washed all these up, and. So you're gonna make three. Three candles, because I only have three wicks. I know. I know Good. the struggle is real. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay. So we're going to um, put the wax in a crock like, pot. Um, hmm? like how would it like We're, we're going to glue. In here? Yeah, yeah. We're going to glue the wick in the glasses and then we'll pour the wax and then the wax hardens. Yep. So we will glue it in? Just the wick. <laughs> That's what we're doing. Okay. So I'm using an old crock pot that is actually one of my friends. But I, I forgot to show you all these before I put them in. These are the beeswax. Let's see if I can pick it up. That actually, another friend gave me these. Aren't those so beautiful? Tell me when it's done. I know. I really, I kind of wanted to keep them because they're just so pretty. But it'll be fun to use them up too. So these are going to melt in the crock pot. So this is just like an old crock pot that has been used for doing stuff like this. So this is not used for food, just FYI. Yep, it did. All right, there we go. Still really hasn't been on that long. Yeah. All right, good job. This has got to be one of the most relaxing, fun things to do. You used a pen. <laughs> I did. So we hot glued the wick, you know, in the bottom of the uh She's trying to make class. more. Yeah, I have some more beeswax. I'm wondering if I should melt some more to do the third. So we only had enough for two of those cute little uh, beeswax cubes that 
I showed y'all. And um, you spilled it. Yeah, I'm gonna, once it's hardened, I'll uh, scrape it off. But look, like it's all hardened on the outside on this one, but not that one. I wonder why. That one is starting too. It is, but this one I just poured. Maybe this mm -hmm. one was actually cooler. Yeah. Because it sat off the crock pot for a bit. I don't know. Mm -hmm. It's just so fun. <laughs> Look at how cute that is. I'm just loving these glasses. Okay, y'all. I did it. Goodness. And my makeup is like all worn off. So, I had a cleaning today. I've been avoiding the dentist for a good while. Um, but I even got special mouthwash. I'm not really that worried about mouthwash that's not that big of a deal but oh I just really don't I don't know anybody that like is like woohoo I'm going to the dentist but it just honestly causes me some anxiety but I did it got the cleaning done um all that I have been having a TMJ and clenching my jaw and so it's causing me a good bit of pain so that's what kind of sparked me Jessica you just need to go to the dentist everything looks good um they are just recommending I could do a mouth guard, night guard thing, or I'm probably just need to see an orthodontist, which I don't want to do. Um, <laughs> like, oh, so can I just whine for a minute? It just feels like it's just so much. Um, I'm pretty sure it's, I'm assuming it's stress that's causing me to clench, but it's causing me a good bit of like headaches and like grinding I don't know that I'm grinding my teeth but I'm moving my teeth or like it feels my, like my teeth have shifted because of the clenching if that makes sense oh, so I do have to take care of myself but it just feels like a lot at this moment <laughs> like we just have so much going on um and life just this past year has been hard like I don't have another word for it so okay I'll stop whining now but I did it and there was no like excessive things to be concerned about except I should go to the orthodontist and y'all I'm paying for I don't know how many kids and braces at this point you know Taylor's done Addie needs her second set um which starts in January Peyton is almost paid for as of like this month I believe <clears throat> and then Jackson needs braces he might not and Add Addison and Jackson need like extensive dental work <sighs> okay I'll stop whining now anyways I gotta run to the store run home all that stuff and y'all I'm just having all the feels I meant to share this earlier last night I had a high school graduation meeting for Taylor it's just so hard to believe that we're here you know like they everybody says it goes by fast and to jo enjoy every minute and I like really try but it's like it's here like she's graduating she is so ready and she's doing so good I'm so proud of her but my mama heart is just like, it's hurting. Um, but it's a big year. So we got to get senior pictures taken. I've got to order the graduation thing um, that, you know, they talked about last night. So being homeschoolers, we do a full graduation. You don't have to, but we, we are going to opt to do it. Because I just feel like it's a proud moment that we should celebrate. So, okay, that was a lot. Dennis, graduations, all the things. Y'all, that's one thing that I don't think I was necessarily prepared for or really thought about with being a mom to a large family and having, you know, 17 year old graduating and a two year old, like, and all the ages in between, just, I am experiencing so many things in one day from, you know, the toddler cuddles to, you know, the other kids like needing to talk about, you know, whatever, and then planning the high school graduation and college and all this stuff. I'm just like, and trying to take care of myself in the meantime. Okay, all right, I'm for real done. Never mind. I kind of feel like that was a lot. Was that a lot? I'm sorry. I needed to verbally vent and whine for a minute. <laughs> okay, back home. Kind of feel like I was a little all over the place. We did school, we made candles, and oh, I just had a cleaning done. But then I had a dentist appointment, you know, all that stuff. <laughs> always so much going on i didn't really finish my thought y'all this has just been so relaxing reagan did a good job did you enjoy making the candles yeah, yeah. it's just a lot of fun i just wanted to say that like if you have it, it was so easy too i really enjoyed it yeah they've been having fun burning the candles too um 
But sorry, I'm a little all over the place, but as I mentioned, I'm pulled in many different directions in one day. So it's also Wednesday. So we're doing, uh, sure. Um, so quick dinner. We're not gonna go to our dance class tonight. I just could not pull off all the things today. I ran into the store after my dentist appointment and there's just no, I would be cutting it way too close on time. And I just didn't wanna, sh you know, some things we just have to say no to. So, um, we're gonna have dinner and then we're gonna go to church. But y'all, Kinley woke up with pink eye from her nap. So now I'm like trying to figure out what to do with that because obviously she can't go to church. So, um, trying to coordinate with Nathan and see how we're gonna handle that. I'm like, I'm telling y'all. <laughs> Oh my goodness, she's okay. Just she actually was pretty irritable today too. But just one thing after another thing. All right, dinner of champions here, y'all. Some night just called for chicken nuggets and fries. We did not have time for anything else. Sometimes we gotta rely on convenience food just to get dinner out. So totally, you know, chicken nuggets and fries. The kids are thrilled with that, by the way. Um, they did happen to have strawberries. They ate all those before the chicken nuggets were even ready. Sometimes I have homemade sourdough bread for them as well. Um, but that's just, we just had to do a quick, easy thing for dinner tonight because there was no time today. Y'all, it is 5.50 outside. It is dark, like you can kind of see a little bit out, but it's so dark. That time change, y'all, it gets me every time. Like, like why do we do this? Um, so Nathan was able to get home in time from work to get the kids that wanted to go to church, go to church. So I am home with all the little kids, obviously Kinley, um, Drew and Camden. They wanted to stay home, but also I was saying it's probably best that they stay home in case they happen to have, um, start with pink eye tomorrow or something. And Logan also wanted to stay home. So we're cleaning up after dinner madness. Um, and then that's gonna be it for tonight. So I was just gonna end this video here. I feel like this vlog was a little choppy. I apologize. But, you know, it's just kind of how some days go. Anyways, thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. And we'll see y'all in the next video.